I think training is the hardest part, but the one who pays off the most. So I did four laps straight, you're dead at the end, so. Because you have to pedal, but push in the same time, jump. Like trying to scrub or whatever. I'm struggling a bit without my coach. Okay, I don't exactly remember, but I put my own sauce in it. Just like, I try to make the most of it. To be ready for Fort William. Pretty hard today. When I was eight, I used to love riding my BMX bike. Everyone was laughing because I was riding with a jeans and a shit bike and old things and that guy was fast but doesn't look good. So this is one of the first helmet I got and I was really not proud of it because it's just white, looked like a skeleton. Fits me quite well, just a bit like, for Andrew would be sick. and there's my name on the side. That's awesome. My dad explained to me that he loves to care about his children. So he built that house and a big one for, for us. There's like my grandpa, grandma, my brother, and my parents. We are living on the same floor, on the same path. And it's just like really cool, because I love my family and we are really close and we always do some stuff together. Yeah, so this trail, the first time I did it was with my dad and I was maybe 11 or 12 with uh, my first brand new bike and it's really, 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 really rocky it's just like really, really hard to get the good speed to be smooth through the corner, smooth everywhere like and you're slowing down so it's just like a challenge and once you get the good speed, I think you, you can ride whatever you want. Salut, je suis Claude Vergier, le père de Loris. Quand Loris était petit, il voulait tout le temps faire du vélo et faire des courses de vélo le dimanche avec moi lorsque je roulais. C'est incroyable que Loris et Loïc soient tous les deux au top niveau aujourd'hui. Et je pense qu'ils sont tous les deux un petit peu singuliers. So the road to go to Rubion is just insanely, not long, but it's just like... So we always stop to the boulangerie. We take like croissant or pain au chocolat. It's the best chocolate croissant. I've learned some pretty cool stuff from my dad first, my brother, Loic. We were in the same club and Rubion was the first place we went because we can ride all together there because there's like a lift. Yeah, this place is pretty special because the, it's the only place that we go to and there's actually normal dirt and not rock or dust. So normally it's raining all the time and that's where we learn to ride mud because <laughs> there's no mud uh, in South of France otherwise. This is the place I grew up and I learned how to ride a downhill bike. I think my first ever downhill was here with my dad's uh, bike. I wasn't even allowed to race. My dad is always happy about me going fast and me having fun on the bike and not being like just focused on winning or whatever. When I was younger and still we ride together and it's quite fun and I think he's happy about it even if I'm faster than him. So with Loic, he's always been uh, a bit like a, a big brother. Since Loic uh, knew I was riding 29ers, he doesn't speak to me anymore. And for his birthday, 
I want to, yeah, make friends again. So I make him a gift card. Sorry, yesterday I forgot your present. So just like a gift card. Yeah, I was like, fuck you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> It's done. I mean. <laughs> uh, good eyebrow. The job on the eyebrow is pretty good. <laughs> now thank you for your present. We're gonna go uh, yeah. on nut wheels. There's no wheels now. It's just water. Floris is uh, my uh, longest friend, I think. We grew up together. My, our parents were so close when we were young and our dad we used to race the same races. So we were just hanging out all the time together and we became best friends. And uh, we started to race together. We had all these uh, experience, I would say, together. And then it's really, uh, yeah, it's a second family. Uh, I went into the water and I'm not even cold. So I'm stuck. Really cool day at the beach. Yeah, I like cars. I like going fast on everything. So I've got, my first car was a kind of a slow car, but I love it, it's good for training and crashing. But we want to sound like a rally car. Just like, oh, oh. if it doesn't sound like that, it's not a good car. This is my Ferrari. I love it. <laughs> See you tomorrow. My best friend is a cross country rider since maybe the beginning. And we are doing some Fun stuff, just laughing at nothing. Cameron is a good driver, and I saw some video. He's jumping this thing, so I'm pretty scared right now. I was like, okay, this is impossible. And it's just like, doo -doo 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 -doo. Well, struggling a bit, but still, it's crazy. This guy is good. <laughs> Being with my friends and having fun was just the perfect day. So Port William was a bit uh, strange again. Like I did a good quality and trying to stay on my bike on the race run. And after the first few corners, like something I didn't expect happened. And I went straight over the track and trying to run up and go back on track. But anyway, yeah, that was a hard race again. I think Greg, everyone has a lot to learn from him. He won the quality, he won the race. He yeah, handled the pressure, he's so good. Seventh win in Port William. I think it's its home track almost. I feel like I'm young still, and Greg is just like the man, the king. So I have to learn a bit. We are in Leogang, Austria. It's nice for the moment. There's some big mountains. And the track seems to be a, even more like one line track and just no many different lines and stuff. But anyway, yeah, we're gonna try to manage and have the best speed every corner and every single time we can. So it's gonna be a tough race and really close race. I hope I'll be where I want to be and with a good run. Feeling good, it's warm, warmest of the year and I'm pretty sure we're gonna have fun so I'm quite keen to go actually, I'm ready for it. This track is like really fast and if you can really push hard but if you push a tiny too hard you can crash or lose everything and same if you just want to say okay I'm gonna cruise down and you're gonna be like 20 or 30 it's insane so I think it's gonna be hard to have the, the right pace and to get the good feeling you know and stay smooth and get everything done but yeah I'm excited for quality for sure
decent quality, like good. I did some different lines and on the bottom I felt a bit slow just to be, you know, trying some grab, some points and not crash. So. Everyone is going fast and the less mistakes you do and the faster you be. So it's a mix in between don't make mistakes and really push hard. So it's going to be tough tomorrow. Sunday, race day. I don't think it's raining today. I think it's going to be hot and sunny, which is perfect. The hotter, the better. Yeah, it looks like the track will be the same for everyone for once. So it's going to be amazing. Without rain and without wind, it's going to be a good race. It's really fast already and it's going to be even faster today. So sketchy, but anyway, we have to push a bit and trying to stay on the bike. I think Greg is gonna smash it, like, he's too fast, you see. Pretty good day, all the team bro, oh my god, it's so good. Nothing like kicking back a cold one after a day at work. The team is so solid and it's a good feeling. Thanks for the beer. Today was kind of a good track and end up team of the day. Perfect day. It was kind of tough after the few two races because we struggled a bit. And right now we are in the pace and feels better and a bit less pressure and we're coming, we're grabbing some points on those guys so we are here and careful guys. Greg is insane, it's, it's good to watch, good to learn so I'm learning and <laughs> he's just drinking all the time, that's the problem. <laughs> he smoked us this week, well done brother. Oh Flip what a day, second, third and seventh, amazing yeah, you've got a killer team, it's um, Great atmosphere with great new young guns that can put up good results and we know Lars can do well on this track and he, he did it again today. So yeah, what a day. So